Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. 1.19.6 just dropped from Minecraft Bedrock yesterday for most of us. Uh, I saw a few posts where people were saying they hadn't got the update yet. They have got the update and folks were having a lot of problems updating for PC it seemed. Most of the console players are, and the other devices seemed to be okay but it was the PC folks like myself that were having a little bit of an issue with getting the update. So I thought I would do a quick video today to show you how to update Minecraft for Windows or the Bedrock version for your PC. So where you want to do is you want to go down here to the start button and click on the start button. Now for me, I've got stuff pinned over here. I've got Minecraft there and some other things and you can see the Microsoft Store right there. If you do click the start button and it doesn't come up and it's not pinned right there, what you can do is you can go back, you can go to your search button down here. You can type in Microsoft Store. Just type in Microsoft and there it is right at the top of the list, Microsoft Store app. Click that, either one, you can click either one and open up the app. When the app comes up, you'll see the store. You know, you've got all of your apps in here, all the apps here, the gaming apps, movies and TV, you can browse for all kind of stuff. Then down at the bottom left, you've got something that says library. Click that and it'll bring up the list of the apps on your computer that, you know, it's just like a little shortcut that you can get to. And as you can see, since I haven't updated yet, Minecraft for Windows is right here at the top. So all you have to do is click update and it'll start updating Minecraft for Windows. You let that run through, make sure that you don't have that instance of Minecraft open and running on your computer. If you do, you'll have to shut it down. You may even have to restart your computer. I've never had to restart my computer. Um, I, I, I'm not going to say you will or you won't. Uh, it's usually a good idea just to restart after an update, just to make sure everything's uh, you know up to speed. If anything's running in the background on your computer, it resets itself if, if it's tied to the program that you're updating. It's just kind of an, always a good idea. So we'll let this update, and then I'll open up Minecraft, and we'll see if we're downloaded or uh, updated to the latest version, which is 1.19.6. Um, we're just about there. So it doesn't take long. I mean, I have a pretty decent computer. I don't have a top of the line gaming rig, but I have a pretty decent computer, so it doesn't take too long. So there we go. So I'm just going to close this down. We're going to open up Minecraft. And of course, it's opening on the other screen. Let me pull it over when it gets opened up. Um, how do I make it not full screen? Go into settings. I should have done a little bit of prep work and made sure it was on the right screen before I open it up. Uh, video. Okay, now it stopped. It may be initializing something since it was updated. And there we go. So let me pull this over to the screen. And as you can see down here at the bottom, it is version 1.19.6. So I am now updated and ready to play on the realms or servers or wherever I want to play. So I hope that helps. Again, uh, I just saw a lot of people having a little bit of an issue and it's really not that hard, but like anything, if you've never done it before, you really don't know what to do. It, it could be the hardest thing in the world, but I hope that helps. Remember, if it did help, feel free to leave a like. If you've not subscribed to the channel, feel free to subscribe. I'm, I'm getting back into starting to make some more content for the channel. So looking forward to that. But until I do see you guys again, remember, our motto here is game your way. Thank you.